If you can do it, your soul can do it. Hey everybody, it's Pastor Chris. Great to be with you as we continue our series, Summer of Soul. And we learn how to care for your soul by journeying along the life of a man named David. Now, to bring you up to speed or to refresh your memory and what we talked about last week, last week David escapes uh, a king named Saul. Now, after that episode and during this whole season of his life, David and this band of men who were with him, uh, they, they were incredibly successful in any battle they had in behalf of the king, kingdom of Israel. They defeated the Philistines, the Moabites, the Syrians, the Amalekites, the Edomites, the Jebusites. Everywhere they went, they won. All I do is win. Now, every week in our series, we've talked about how our soul rests, or our soul is knit together with another, or our soul waits, or our soul hungers and thirsts. But today, with after all of these victories, instead of being proud and arrogant, David says, my soul boasts in the Lord. And you're gonna unpack that phrase because actually it means a lot more than we realize. Because right now, your soul is boasting in something. The question is, what is it? And before you draw a conclusion of whether you agree or disagree with that statement, you're gonna unpack what that phrase actually means and then to see what is it your soul is boasting in. It's gonna be a great discussion. You guys have a great time. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye.